what's up y'all welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is jayla um my name is joy so i go by jayla joy today we're gonna be doing this like soft glam look um, i've been wearing this look all week and it was only right to record a video because i was really feeling it i don't forget to subscribe and if you want to see this look keep on watching <sighs> all right y'all so let's get into this video i'm about to do my eyebrows i just washed my face and my face is dry uh, so i'm gonna put some moisturizer on okay so if you guys watched any of my previous videos then you know that I always be using this mirror, but it broke in one of the videos that I was recording. So I got this mirror now. I'll take the price tag off it, but I got it from the dollar store. And it was just another thing to spend money on. By the way, my vanity is right this way. It's like right here. So that's probably why I'm like always reaching over to grab stuff. By the way, I'm using this NYX professional makeup micro brow pencil this is one of my faves um i've been using it for some months now okay so now we're gonna move on to the eyes i'm gonna prime my eyes with some concealer um, let me use this born, the born this way. It's pretty full, so I just do two dabs, or just a couple. This is the original one like this is the og palette i got this like maybe like three years ago four years ago i don't know but it's been some time but this is like the one of the first palettes that they came out of like it still kind of looks the same but this is what it looks like and this is really great for like like soft glam looks um neutral looks stuff like that so yeah of course you can purchase this on morphine.com but yeah, so we're going to be using this palette. I have so many palettes by Morphine. So like I'm really trying to use all these, all, all of them. So that's my goal is to use all of them on my channel before like I give them away or I'm not going to throw them away. Probably donate them, something, I don't know. But some of these brushes I'm about to be using are dirty. I'm just going to say that right now because no makeup artist like of course makeup artists are clean but of course there's makeup that gets everywhere but like i've been doing this look for i've been doing this look all week to like kind of like master it um make sure i know how to make it look good when i was trying to film this video right now so yeah but i'm gonna start with this um brush this is one of the new brushes that i got some time ago i just started using them they've been sitting on my vanity for a minute they're really soft if i um bh cosmetics i got a 12 set for like less than 30 dollars so maybe like 28 or something but they are really soft so bh cosmetics got it going on sis okay if you don't know about them you better check them out but so i'm gonna first start off by using this color right here All in my upper crease um i think with these og morphine palettes they didn't come out with any names or anything you know what now that i think about it i'm gonna zoom in so you guys can really see morphine brush this is a brush that came in a set and i'm gonna use um this color right here i'm 
My dog was like barking right at my door. She kept barking and barking and barking. And I thought she was trying to go in my mom's room, but she's supposed to be trying to come in my room. So I opened the door and she comes running in and searching around. But I really think that she'd be doing that to check up on us or something. Like my dog, if you don't know, my dog's a German Shepherd mixed with Husky. That's my baby. She's literally laying underneath me. She was snoring at one point. Hopefully you guys don't hear that in the video, but I couldn't turn it down because she don't sleep in my room all the time. So when she does, it's special. For, she's protective for one of me and my mom. She doesn't like when me and my mom fight, or not fight, but when me and my mom argue. It's so funny because every time me and my mom argue and we're yelling at each other or whatever, she'll start barking like, hey, like stop it. You like that's it's really crazy. We're about to darken the crease. You see how I told you like it's not too pigmented, but it you know it's just right. But now we're about to darken the crease, and I'm gonna start with this color right here. And I've already used this brush, and this is like the brush that I use to like darken the eye. So to darken it more, you want to kind of dab it in there because if you dab, that gets the more product in. And just kind of makes the finish better but you also want to blend too because you don't want it to be patchy so you just gotta make sure you blend and dab at the same time let me use this color now yeah, this color, and then I'm going to do this color too. So both these colors to darken up the crease. Same brush. concealer by the way and I just put it on this brush and I use the same this is the same brush I used to cover out my brows but I think I'm about to use a different I think I'm about to use the born this way because I use the toothpaste and I'm running out of the toothpaste and it's funny because Ulta just had a sale where it was half off and I thought you know I have enough makeup so I really don't need it but you know, these last couple days I've been using Nart Tarte, and I'm like, damn, I, I like, I really like Tarte, and so I really should have bought another one, but I didn't because I'm trying not to. Back when I worked at Ulta, like that's what I would always spend my money on, and now that I don't work there anymore, uh, I don't be spending my money on makeup no more. take this this Sasha buttercup and set this eyelid because um because if I don't I'm gonna crease it up and then I'm gonna have concealer all over my lids so and we don't want that I just cut it halfway and now I'm about to use use between these two colors anyways about my nails so I just popped them off because when you get ombre like you can only get a fill on ombre like you can't get a regular set and that's why I had to just take them off because um because I want to get a different set now. I kind of want to try the natural look. Like, I've been seeing everybody and they've been trying the natural look where, like, you barely have, you don't have the long nails, which is cool, but I don't know if I want that because I really have small hands. And the reason why I get long nails is because it makes my hands look bigger and it, it just looks way better than, in my opinion. 
So I'm just going to take a little bit and I'm just going to put it right here just to darken it up like that. I'm about to put on some lashes and I will be right. All right, so this is the lashes I'm wearing. Um, they probably look really long on camera, but they don't even touch my eyebrows, so. But this is the lashes. These are called Wifey Wispy by JXJ Beauty. I'm gonna use the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I don't usually use primer, but this one's been cutting it, so. And it's pretty boring. Um, I don't really have textured skin, but I do be having little bitty bumps. You know how you be having little bitty bumps that are there when you put foundation on, but you don't notice when you're in your just natural skin? Yeah, that's what I got. And I'm pretty blurred. Okay. So I'm about to put on um, the Maybelline. You can tell I've been using this because this is that shit. Okay, period. Poo. Um, this is up to 24 hour foundation. I'm in the color 334. And this is warm sand. It's cheap, affordable, beauty on a budget, period. One on my... I don't use too much foundation, to be honest with you. Because I also put on powder, too. And I'm going to take this um, a cosmetic foundation brush. Yes, it's cute. Get into it. <laughs> David Sonia Beats Don't Call. Purchase beats with no tags. So let me go wet it. I'll be right back. Switch. Okay, so it's pretty skin like. Um, now I'm gonna take. My Tarte concealer that's running out, as you can see, and I'm gonna just dab it. I put a little bit on my nose. I don't like too much highlight on my nose. It's crazy because I really wasn't like that big of a fan when it came to beauty blenders, but I'm actually. Like, it's really starting to dig beauty blenders, and it's crazy because, like, I really was just a brush girl, and now I'm actually starting to like beauty blenders surprisingly. Make sure, like, I mellow down my concealer. Okay, so I probably look crazy now, but trust the process. Boom. And now I'm about to take some uh, banana powder. This one's by Makeup Revolution, color is banana. Okay. And I, I saw this on somebody's channel, but what I did. What I would do is I'm gonna wipe on this foundation so I my hand. So what I would do is I'd take it in my like little bowl and I would dab it in there and I would dab it on my hand. Now 
sub on there. I forgot who I've seen this from, but it uh, it works pretty well. Um, by the way, I used the Tarte in Tan, if anybody was wondering. Mineralizing Skin Powder. I in love with this stuff because it just makes my face look very seamless and matte. Gives me a little more coverage because like I said, I don't put too much foundation on. And I'm going to use Hoola. This is like what I got in the travel. I know it looks ghetto, but whatever, I don't care. Maybe I'll buy the big one soon. You never know. But you just brought things. I don't really like, I mean, contour is cool and all, but I cut the contour. Let me contour my nose real quick. I don't want to do it too much. And this it doesn't have nothing on it just to let you guys know. Okay. Now we're gonna take one of my favorite things, which is blush. My two favorite things with makeup is eyelashes and blush. And this is the next brush, OG. Um, you know, doing YouTube, I probably should start switching up my makeup. But, honey, when stuff is good, you gotta hold on to it. And when it's making you look good, oh, there's no doubt. Period. So, I don't know. Now we're gonna spray with some continuous. Ugh. It has like some perfume. See, now my mirror is all messed up. It look, has kind of a perfume scent. Like when you sniffing up, you, you um. This is the MAC. Go with the posit. New blip. You already know it's coming, honey. Okay? Because that's all I do is a new blip period so you line my lips i'm lining it with this lip line or eyeliner so it's more pigmented um so yeah This is the NYX um, lingerie gloss. Hopefully 
guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're new here thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe if you want to know about these lashes they're by my brand jxj beauty um they're in the style wifey wispy my website will be down below don't forget to follow me on the gram okay and on the snap so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye